So what came in the mail a few days back is Blackpink's official Lightstick version 2 limited edition. Now, is it better than the original Blackpink Lightstick? We'll find out in today's video. What up YouTube? So for this video, we will be comparing Blackpink's version 1 and version 2 official Lightstick. Now from the get-go, you will be able to see that the version 1 box is slightly larger than that of the version 2 limited edition box. The other differences from the version 2 box, you can see that it is coated all in pink. All sides are coated in pink and the text and images are all in black. While in version 1, it's a different story where, where the size alters from black and pink and the text and images just uh, goes to what the base colors opposite is. And from the front, there's not much of a difference when it comes to the logo and the text. Uh, you can see here it says Blackpink Official Light Stick for the version 1, while in the version 2, it has almost the exact same text, but it's just it just says an additional uh, Official Light Stick version 2 limited edition. It is worthy to note that on the version 1, you will only be provided with the photo cards if you pre-ordered the light stick. I do have that set of photo cards but it's currently in my photo book which I am too lazy to get right now. But the version 2 has the official photo cards taped on top of the box which is really scary because when you try to remove the tape you should be very careful as to not damage the box. Now if you were able to successfully remove the photo cards from top of the box without damaging it, congratulations you have the four girls photo cards in your possession. Now here is Jesus uh, photo card. Okay, you see, and then from the back you have this logo uh, of the version 2 lightstick. Well it's not really a logo, it's a photo of it. But yeah that that's Jisoo. Next up is uh, we have here Lisa holding up the version 2 light stick and from the back you'll be able to see the photo as well and then next up is Rose Cheyang uh, look at that cute photo of Cheyang holding up the hammer bong against her head and then uh, from the back another different photo of the version 2 light stick at a different angle with uh, what seems to be soap I know that Blackpink has soap uh, soap merchandise but yeah I think that's what those are at the back and then last but definitely not the least uh, we have here Jenny now it is worthy to take note that the signature that you will, that you saw on the previous photo cards are just printed on on the photo card and same photo at the back. And once you're done gazing at your photo cards, you can slowly set them to the side and we can go on to the good stuff. All right. Now straight out of the box, you'll be able to see that the light stick is already right there. Uh, there's no styrofoam or any protective coating for the light stick. Now I'm just pulling it up. Oh yeah, there is a provided um, stand for the light stick, unlike on the version one. And there, uh, as you can see, it still has that plastic protective plastic right there now I just need to remove this I think okay I got the light stick it's slightly different than the version one but we will see now straight out of the box aside from the actual light stick itself uh, the key difference is this one which is the uh, light stick stand because I believe you can also utilize the version 2 as a mood uh, mood lamp or mood mood light stick something like that I am aware that the version 1 of the twice light stick uh, can also be uh, used as a mood lamp so maybe it uh, was inspired by that feature from uh, the twice version 1 light stick so here is the version 2 
uh, nightstick so it still resembles the version 1 it still looks like an ordinary hammer bomb from afar now um, we have here the version 1 uh, nightstick and then this is the version 2 if this was taken apart uh, there's not much of a difference now from the version 1 you'll be able to identify that here you have this plastic that has this uh, sort of like metallic finish to it right here at the base of the hammer at the version 2 you, uh, you'll be able to see that uh, it's in just um, plastic which is not it has a metallic feature now there's the button here which is uh, in pink while here on the version 1 uh, the button is right here with the uh, same finish as the uh, plastic metallic thingy here on um, on the base of the hammer mom. Now, version 1, you just click on it and then it lights up. It's very, very light. So it's very convenient to bring uh, during a uh, during the Blackpink's concert uh, in your area tour in Manila. There wasn't much of an issue holding this up because it is extremely light and it is uh, not very fragile and you can basically well hit people with it. You know, you can. It's designed to do so, so you don't need to baby this light stick at all. So uh, you will need two uh, AAA batteries for this uh, version one light stick. But yeah, uh, this review is, will not focus on that one. We will focus on this one, uh, the version two light stick. Now the key difference is this one, right? From the appearance. Now when we, we turn this on, you can see that that also lights up. Okay. Now uh, that is the key difference here. Uh, this one doesn't light up, and the actual. Um, how do you say this? The handles. Uh, version 1 is a bit slimmer while the version 2 is a bit thicker. Now, I think the main reason why the version 2 is a bit thicker is this has a Bluetooth capability. Now, um, if you have your phone with you, uh, you can actually download the Blackpink application, which is uh, available, I believe, both in Apple Store and uh, Play Store. So, I'll just connect this with uh, my phone. Okay. Uh, if you press twice, it will have this blue color effect. Now, uh, just follow the. There it is. It's connected to the light stick, and um, it has the following features. Now. You can see that scroll bar controls the brightness of the light stick itself. Now, to be honest, it's a bit slow. Turning it down to the lowest volume, to the lowest uh, brightness, up to the brightest. And then that's basically it. Uh, there's no, uh, there's no, way for you to put this in a specific song we're in um, nothing it's not much just that and then disconnect so yeah that's the only feature so I think unless you are truly at a black pink concert and if YG or if the management just decides to control your light stick only then will you be able to fully utilize the Bluetooth capability. Now, uh, with that being said, uh, we would like to move on to the most important feature of the version 2 light stick, which is... Yes, it maintained this. It maintains the squeaky sound that the light stick makes whenever you bonk it to something. So yeah, um, now this uh, primarily has this micro USB port, mainly uh, you can take off the batteries uh, from this light stick and maybe put it on the stand and then you know have it as like your mood light or something and control, the, control it uh, from, from the app. 
you know if you're a die-hard blink then this may, might be something that you would like next to your bed or at your workstation but uh, if you were to not utilize that micro USB port uh, you will need three AAA batteries to power up this thing which is like the standard nowadays but on the version one just do so you can get away with um, cheap batteries for this one but for this one ah, you'll need uh, AAA batteries and I would encourage you guys to invest in rechargeable AAA batteries if you are a multi fandom uh, multi fandom fan like me so yeah now let's move on to the final question um, is the version 2 limited edition light stick worth it uh, is it worth your money it is currently at uh, 2,000 pesos when, uh, when you convert it uh, to Philippine pesos, Philippine money, uh, 2,000 pesos for this light stick, and I was able to get it uh, for actually not cheaper because I bought it straight from Korea. I got it from KpopTown.com, so uh, the shipping fee was really expensive for this light stick. So yeah. I would encourage you to buy this with possibly a pasabay or uh, a group order but if you're like me and you can't wait you want uh, the fast delivery then you will need to pay at least 1500 with the shipping fee so uh, 2000 plus uh, 1500 I spent like 3000 pesos 35 for, for this I think I don't remember so what I did is just I bought this and then something else uh, to maximize the shipping fee for not just one item now for the version one this was extremely cheap to be honest because this was unofficialized stick and I did not buy it from a local store I bought it directly from Korea like you would convert the price it would be at 900 pesos 900 to 1000 pesos but uh, the shipping fee would be the one that will uh, jump up the price as I said like it will increase it for like uh, 1500 more so yeah I, 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 I this thing is just extremely light you know I feel like it's Mjolnir or something Bring me Thanos. And with that being said, I believe that wraps up this video regarding the version 2 official limited edition light stick from Blackpink. Now, is it worth your money? I'll leave that up to you. So, uh, please do not forget to drop a like on this video. Consider subscribing to the channel and I'll see you guys on the next video. <laughs> Bye.